baby, 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 baby. You're driving me wild, you're driving me so crazy. Got me acting out, got me tryna stay sober. Got me tryna stay sober. Wanted your love and I'm out here hungover. You made me wanna take you to London, Paris. Make some times with cherries. Baby, that's no comparing to you. Don't need Keisha Karen. Don't want Meg and Sharon. Girl, I swear that it ain't fair. It ain't fair that. a little bit different today i wanted to switch it up a little bit this color is very beautiful but i think it's like a little bit too bright for me went to walmart and i purchased some color in a box revlon i've used it before this is in deep burgundy i just want to tone it down just a little bit give it more of that you know that fall vibe so i'm gonna go ahead and apply the color shampoo and deep condition this wig and then i'm gonna come back style it and then give you guys my final thoughts Y'all already know how I do, so let's get it to it. $173.43. 
Now, remember, you determine if the price is right for you. I'm just here to teach you how to lay and slay these wigs, baby. Okay, that's what I'm here for. And to send me y'all, and to give y'all a good laugh, okay? Oh, McDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Hey, and on that farm, he had shaved me. E-I-E-I-O. With a slay, slay here, and a slay, slay there. Here, slay there. I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys the cons first and then I'm gonna drop them pros on you and then we gonna wrap this video on up. The first con I would have to say about this wig is that I did not like the color. I was very honest with Julia Hair. I was like, listen, this is more of a fire red and not a 99J and I ain't feeling it. And you know, they apologized about it and they said that their factory is working on it. I wasn't feeling the color. I had to spice it up just a little bit. You know, like the Spice Girls, if you wanna be my lover, you gotta get with my friends, make it last forever, friendship never ends. Yes, y'all, I had to spice it up. Just call me Sha Spice Girl, okay? Sha Scary Spice. <laughs> Another con I would have to say is the fake scalp. I really wasn't here for the whole fake scalp is because it was too light for your girl. And it turned burgundy anyway from the dye, but I was gonna cut it out initially when I first saw it because that doesn't work for me because my skin tone is so dark. Those are the only two cons that I have to say about this wig, y'all. So let's jump right into the pros. The first pro I would have to say about this wig is the hair. Okay, the color took very, very, very well. Like, no words. Just, I'm so excited because it turned out so good. I did receive some shedding and tangling while I was shampooing and deep conditioning the hair after I colored it, but that's expected. Now, I'm not getting no shedding. I'm really not. And I'm receiving a few snags, but it's nothing worth getting upset about. Um, very soft hair. As you can see, it's nice and bouncy. This wig will hold a curl, but I didn't have any good holding spray to hold my curls when I pin curl them so they kind of starting to fall, but it's all good in the neighborhood, y'all, because I still look good, okay? Another pro I would have to say is that this wig is a lace closure. I love lace closure, y'all, because they're so beginner friendly. They really are throw on and go type wigs because you don't have to melt them down. You may have to add some makeup to make the lace match your skin tone. I did use my lace tint spray to make it match my skin tone. And I laid this wig down because I wanted to, okay? And I'm extra and I wanted to serve scalp, okay? <laughs> I really did. I've been doing all these headband wigs. I was like, ooh, lace, lace, lace. Let me lay it on down. Yes! You gotta go downtown. That's the way to my love. Yes! I love a good lace, y'all. I love Delta lace. Especially the more I get better at it, I'm like, give me lace. Give me lace. Give me lace. Me late. This wig was too big for your girl. That really isn't a con. My head size is a 22. I do have on my wig grip underneath this wig and it ain't going nowhere. I've been swinging this wig all day. I told y'all it took me a long time to record these wigs. So that's why my curls fell because I was taking pictures, posing, twerking, <laughs> dancing with my dogs in the nighttime. Yeah. Drop a comment down below and let me know, are you feeling this transformation? Do you like the color? Cause what? Get into it. Once again, I would like to send a big, big thank you to Julia Hair for sponsoring today's video. If you like today's video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up for your girl. If you have any comments or any questions, or you just want to say what's up, drop it down below and you know I will talk back to you. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. It's the big red button down below because I know you see it. I know you see it. I know you see it. Yes. As always, I thank you guys for watching. I thank you guys for supporting me. And hopefully, I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.